Hello everybody and welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon Blue version. Um, I made a little mistake and for some reason when I went to upload this morning, this file, like the audio was all wonky. It had the wrong audio loaded and I remember editing it correctly, but I don't know. So what I'm going to do, I am going to re-record this episode. I'm pretty sure you didn't want to hear that, but uh, the fact of this ma fact of the matter is, I did do the gym already, right? Uh, let's see. Yep, I just need the 8th badge. We don't know who it is. Although I know who it is, because I've seen the next couple of episodes. I know what happens in them. I've seen the boss fight in the next episode, and I know how stupid it is. Um, I'm pretty sure I need to use a match repel here. Uh, my luck has been pretty terrible the last couple of days, so let's see how this turns out. Hopefully it won't affect this. Uh, I'm sure I'll be fine. Because, well, I, I know what's going to happen. I'm going to go to the gym, I'm going to fight out all the trainers, and then I'm going to get to the boss, well, the gym leader, and just finish him off. So, yes. Uh, bad luck all around. Like, I recorded that Nuzlocke run with Breezy. That's, I'm sure, is going to come out at some point. But uh, apparently something went awry and the files were lost. I'm not going to name names here, but somebody may have lost the files accidentally. Anyways, uh, the fact of the matter is now we have to re-record. But, and, well, that's going to be annoying because I don't like Nuzlocke runs. They, they make me sad. When my Pokemon die, it's not fun times. Cinder! Oh, you guys will never know that terror. Uh, basically, I had I caught a Vulpix. I named it Cinder, and it was killed by a Wild Jirachi. I encountered. Yeah, Wild Jirachi. We had we have random Pokemon encounters, so we can run into any Pokemon that exists through the first three generations. But anyways, I have uh, gym battles to do. And that will definitely be a thing. And first off, this guy whose hair blends in with the background. I don't know what Pokemon I have in front. Okay then, this Tamer sent out Arbok. Be nice if I had Guac, but unfortunately I have Dude. Oh yeah, I, sw I swept Blaine with Dude. Eh, why not? Should try use Rage. Rage! It's not gonna hurt. But poison Sting, don't be poisoned. Just get angry! Yes! You hit dude, he just gets more angry. Yes, hurt him all you want. Just don't poison him. Ah, he poisoned him. Alright, now dude is poisoned. That's an excellent. <laughs> yep, that that's a that's a term I'm going to be coining. Nexcellent. It's neat and excellent combined. Good times with the Nexcellent. Alright, Tauros. Um, I'm going to switch out, yes, I wish I had a fighting type. Um, let's see, uh, Marshall, you shall do fine. Taurus is actually a really good Pokemon, it's got high-ass attack, and I'm pretty sure it's pretty beefy in the defense department. Um, but it's pretty damn rare and can be only found in the Safari Zone, so good luck trying to find one. And my, my normal, it's a pure normal type, so that's also against it since normal is not really good against anything. Although there's, there's nothing really that good against normal, except for, I think, only ghost and fighting, and I'm not even sure about ghost. Alright. So, mm, there is interest in normal type Pokemon. Why am I not using a full heal? I bought like a bazillion of them. Let's see. Uh, full heal... Alright, and Pokemon, wait, what is this guy? Um, he is a fighter, so dude will actually be pretty good for this. Alright, you know, I could have used Marshall as well, but, you know, I probably should have used Marshall now that I think about it, but dude will be fine as well, because flying is good against fighting, if I'm not mistaken. Alright, Machoke, Dab face! It's pretty strong, yeah, we're kind of under-leveled, but 
well, I'm good enough Pokemon player that I can get away with it. My team is diverse and good enough that I can get away with being underleveled as. You'll see in future episodes that I know of because I recorded them already. Oh well. I was planning on just, like, because I, I didn't have the music. That's what happened. I, I did not have the music. I still had the commentary. I was planning on getting uh, a Glitch X City and just, like, uh, putting it in place in the music, but I don't know, that, that kind of doesn't feel right to do an entire damn episode like that. Although I suppose this being sped up wouldn't be too bad. I don't know. If my commentary is just crap here, I might go and do that. Well, well, obviously, by the because of the sheer fact that you are seeing this means that I didn't do that, so I didn't do that. Uh, sorry, I don't know. I don't know what's wrong with my luck today. So, but well, when things happen, you have to fix them. That's just you gotta get right back on the horse and keep on trying. Need a Reno. Probably should have gotten Guac or somebody. I, I swear, this is like another Koga situation. He's, these people are not really using ground types. Well, is Nidorito a ground type? I know Nido King is a ground type, but I don't think he gets the ground subtype until it evolves into Nido King. So, um, I'm not totally sure on that one. Drill pack. Uh, back to me not needing a, a a normal type because my normal type is already um. Uh, let's see. I will switch to Nessie and use Ice Beam. My normal type is already covered with, uh, with Dude because he's half normal type, so, like, he's already half normal type, so why would I need a pure normal type? He used Thrash on Thrash. And I used Ice Beam on Nido King. I need to teach one of my Pokemon Thrash, just, just for the sheer fun of it. Hey, level 42, not bad, not bad at all. I think I used Nessie a little in the, the boss fight. Or am going to? I don't know. It's confusing. This episode's full of all, full of all sorts of time paradoxes. So be wary of such things. All right. Uh, I think I'll give Marshall some exercise because Marshall's pretty much good against a lot of Pokemon because he is a psychic type who is quite broken. Although it's not going to matter who I train here because my levels are going to be different in the next episode. So training up which Pokemon does not matter. Huh, that's an interesting thought. This little tangent that I'm going on in this episode is not going to matter in the slightest. So I don't it doesn't matter if I use up all my PP. It doesn't matter if my Pokemon get poisoned. Although I suppose technically I would have just uh, healed before the boss. So I don't know, it's interesting, but I guess I could just completely spam this place with Marshall if I wanted to. And him leveling up to massive levels when... Oh yeah, he's trying to learn Meditate, which is a terrible move. Uh, I see what they're trying to do here by by uh, having Mr. Mime able to learn Meditate, because his attack is terrible. So they're trying to have him cover that weakness by having him uh, learn Meditate, which raises your attack. Although, Marsh, I combated that by having Marshall just not even have any need or even use for, the, for his attack stat. So Meditate is completely useless to me. Razor, um, my attack fails does not affect me because I'm pretty sure Razor Leaf is a special attack in first gen. Well, I'm pretty sure it's a special attack always. I'm um, not totally sure about that. Alright, this guy's down. Marshall's still in front so I can take out this karate guy real quickly. Roar! Working myself into a rage! Huh, some of his Pokemon should know rage just because they said that. I don't know, it'd be a, a neat little thing. Alright then, Black Belt sent out with Chomp, just gonna use Confusion and wipe this thing out. And there we go. Ah, uh, should be a one-hit KO. Yup, easy. Nothing too special. Alright, Machoke. Um, I think I can take this out with Confusion as well. Uh, taking a chance here, but I think I can do it. Because it is a stronger Pokemon. Oh, critical hit! I wonder if I could have taken out normally, but oh, who knows? I guess we'll never know. Well, I guess we could do, like, the calculation. But who wants to do math in a Pokemon game? I have to go to math class in, like, a few hours. So why would I want to do math here? See, that's the logic of these things. You know, come to think of it, 
why am I even fighting all of these trainers? I mean, I've got a decent enough episode already. I could just skip these trainers and I still would have them fought off screen. I mean, you're really not all that interested in these trainers. I know that. I wouldn't be. Oh, Reinhorn's down. Easy. Yeah, I wouldn't be interested in all these trainers. So, you know what? I see no reason to just, like, end the, not just end the episode here. Well, I better go up to where the, the boss is. Well, I almost said his name. <laughs> and we're not supposed to know his name, specifically, because, uh, check it out. Question mark. We're not supposed to know who this dude is. So, let's just go over here. And I believe we have to fight this guy. So... Yeah, we, we actually have to fight this guy. This fight is required. So we just come up here, talk to him, and then uh, leave the other way. But because we have Marshall, this Karate King guy is not going to be any problem. Yeah, unfortunately there's no fighting type gym in this generation. I believe there's one in Gen 2 and a few more of the generations. But um, in this one, I'm pretty sure there's a fighting gym in Gen 3 as well. I don't know. I don't... I know all of the first-gen gym leaders uh, because I've done my homework for this game, so I could name all of the uh, gym leaders now. I'll do it right now. Brock, Misty, Lieutenant Surge, Erica, Sabrina, Koga, Blaine, and the eighth guy who I could name, but I'm not going to. Uh, well, you'll see him in the next episode. <laughs> you guys already know who it is, but just for the the small sheer fact that you might not, um, oh, it actually survived. Because there's always just that one person who might, hey, not have played the old games, might have been, uh, born into Gen 2 and just started from there and never played, uh, Fire Red or Leaf Green or anything. Who knows? Or maybe just never made it to the 8th gym. That, that's completely plausible because, well, it does take some endurance and strategy to make it all this way in the game. And there are a lot of people who, as kids, would probably just quit at, like, the third gym or something. It's entirely plausible. Am I gonna... Yeah, I'm gonna fight this guy as well. Apparently both these guys are required. You can go the other way to fight that Karate King and then go past him, you're still gonna have to fight this guy on the way over here. Yep. But he's only got one Pokemon, is a Rhyhorn. No big deal. Is Rhyhorn part ground type? I think it's a pure raw. I'm not totally sure. Alright. Fusion. If you're cu curious enough, you can go to Bulbapedia and look look up Rhyhorn. But I am not... I don't know, I just want this episode out there. Okay, then. Cool trainer has been defeated. And, well, I'm going to end the episode off here. About here. Yeah, this is where I, where I started the next episode. So, sorry for the inconvenience of this episode, but, well... Honestly, the old commentary wasn't all that great either. So, uh, this is me, Thrasho2, saying be cool, save often, and don't do anything I wouldn't.